Oh, I can change it. How about here? You know, I might just look this up. All right, I looked it up. Apparently, they go up here, up here, and down here. Oh, the blast signal. That's what I heard, anyway. What exactly does that do for me? I wanted, I wanted to try to figure it out. But I actually have no fucking clue. Uh, hold on. S apparently I'm supposed to have laughing gas, but I don't know where to find it. Where would I find laughing gas? In the emergency room? Huh? Yo, my nuclear ore, I mean... Hmm. Well, let's shut that off. Wait, what do I do with... Can I do this? Ugh. Oh, what the fuck? Everyone's gone. Hello, Lottie. You again? <clears throat> you, you again? Is it my turn already? No. Number 60. Wenzel. Wenzel, exactly! Shit, alright then. I'll skip that. Don't click. Nope. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait a number. Burns the one, but I guess the 63 will have to do. Okay, so now that I have that one, number 62, maybe I can just trade with Wenzel. Hey, Wenzel. What? By the way, so as long as... Mm. I want my just for. Mm-hmm. Lee, exactly. All right, I'm going to the bar. Screw this. I need a drink. <laughs> Lonzo, yeah. Did you hear about the stranger, the girl? Yeah, but I don't care. Don't tell me you want to start quarreling about her with all the other. Well, you know me. <laughs> I'm always the first in line when the uh, <laughs> idiots are quarreling. Yes. There we go. Do you have something that can give someone a real boost? Since when are you ordering coffee? Did you break Tony's coffee machine again? How often do I have to tell you that you don't filter oil that way? Yeah. No, this is not about simple coffee. I need something that really, really gets you awake. A kind of ultimate pick-me-up. Lonzo, are you okay? Okay, just forget I ever asked. I'm off. No, no, wait a minute. I think I know exactly what you need. Oh, shit. Progress. Finally. This is it. This is the moment I've been waiting for. Hey, wow. You have a pipes? Tanks? Valves? It's a, it's a, a it's a thing. This is an espresso machine. But <laughs> this is not just any old espresso machine. This is the model of all espresso machines. I tuned it myself. And you wound ribbons into its hair? Indeed I did. Okay, but one question remains. What exactly is this espresso? Well, to be honest, I'm not sure myself. I think it's a kind of highly concentrated coffee. The people of prehistoric times drank it. Uh-huh. And then they forgot to switch the machine off. <laughs> I see. I beat the compressor following all the instructions that I found. Unfortunately, the pictures were pretty blue, but I think I figured out what ingredients I needed. Take the recipe. It's right next to you on that bar stool. If you bring me these ingredients, we can start brewing. In the meantime, what bar stool? I found my life insurance policy. I hope. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 I'm so excited. Oh, that one. What a scroll. Okay, I need clear reviving and energy rich water. The coffee powder must be black, stimulating, and made from hot beans. It, hmm. 
None of these things can be found in Cuba. I never mind that. Being a master improviser, I bet I can find plenty of alternatives. Right. Okay. So, what do I need to do for that? Huh? What was that? Oh, the emergency station is open again. Oh, oh shit! And I can choose the more daring options now. Well, I'm going in. We need stuff. We need lots of stuff. What can we do with this lever? <laughs> Gizmo isn't here. That means I can fiddle around with his occupation modes unnoticed. Oh, shit. Handcuffs. My right, I can't reach them. Um, can I use the hook to grab them? I'll save my what? But that's logical. Police box. It looked much lighter lying in that cupboard. Foot, foot, foot fetters. Um. That's not gonna flee. Um. On the lever. Never mind. Doctor's cabinet. Crap. Lock. Damn it! All right, how about uh, dentist drill? Taking that and uh, dissecting scalpel. All right, I'm actually making some proper progress. Oh, 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 oh balloons! Yeah. How many do I need? Oh, one will do for now. Okay. 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 So. No great in the world can hold me back. There, while you were blinking. Yeah, it moved while I was blinking. Oh, look, a tree. It's the last tree left. I hope it doesn't croak. I mean, where would I test my herbicide? Oh, shit. I've been recording for a fucking hour. Hello again, Rufus. Exactly. Uh, Do you have any idea? Very often, we, those are always filled with some kind of liquid. We call it battery soda because it's got that fizz when it touches the tongue. Shit. Is that what you mean? You drink it? They drink battery acid. Maybe you have my key. Maybe you have my key, too. Mm, I don't know. What was your name again? Sugar Puff. Sugar Puff. Sugar Puff? Hmm. Maybe I found your key, Sugar Puff, but I need to be sure it really belongs to you. What's your favorite color? Pink. Pink. Pink, you say? That sounds about right. And uh, do you have a special hobby? That's it. I uh, love the ballet. Yeah, bullseye. Then this must be your key. This must be your lucky day, Sugar Puff. Yeah. I'm so happy I could just explode. Really? I might have a one-time job for you down yeah. in the mine. Oh, uh, well, you're funny. Thanks. All right, now that we've got that, we'll check this place out. And actually finally get somewhere with this goddamn car. I might have to end the episode soon, which sucks because I got nothing done. It was just me yelling at myself on the inside because I suck. Take this battery. Oh, what? I can't remove it, but how do I get access to the power that harbored? Right, if I can't remove it, how about this dentist drill? I want the battery acid, and I have a dentist drill. <laughs> That's almost too convenient. Oh, sweet, it works. Ah, ow! <laughs> yeah, ow! Right, how do I contain it? How do I contain it? Tranquilizer? Ah, uh, fuck, okay, uh, da 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 This, the balloons. Are they good? Unfortunately, I already used the urn of Tony... Well done, you are such an asshole. Um, I don't have anything. There's still more stuff that I need to do, apparently. Into the alley. Yeah, oh fuck. Into the emergency room. There's a fire station. Okay, so I need to f I'll take the fire extinguisher out. It's too heavy to lug around. Doesn't matter though, because I'm always cautious. What else can we have? We can have these special gloves, yes. Pick them up. Cool. Okay, uh, what else is there? I can go down the fire escape. 
and this hatch. What's this hatch do? There's a hole in the platform. No? Okay. Um, what do I do with these? What if I... Huh. Oh. How the, how the hell was I supposed to find this out without this walkthrough? No, back up. Strike. Did it. Ha. Handcuffs. Seriously, how was I supposed to find that out? Use the handcuffs on the hatch. Ugh. That means I have to go back to... None of this stuff makes sense. It's just trial and error constantly. Yeah, okay. Now I need to pull the lever. Come on. This is a lot of back and forth. No wonder I couldn't do anything. Great, so now there's a floor open. And there's a lock plug there. Oh, nice. Uh, does that mean I can go underneath or something? How do I get through? Following the walkthrough because I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm going to edit a shit ton of this out. There's a slide somewhere, apparently. Yeah, there it is. There we go. Now I have the lockpick. Whee! You just have to open the cell grating. How would I know any of this? Lockpick. Cell grating. Back to the doctor. I will be the doctor. I'm a very smart man. I will be the doctor. And I will unlock the box. Can I? I thought it was rusted shut. Ugh, I hate syringes. Luckily, I've developed an immunity to tetanus. Nice. That's quite that impressive. Tastes like. I've only ever been injected right into the heart muscle so far. All right. Well then, what's this? Stimulant and syringe. Right. So now I've got the gloves. I can pick up that chili. Right. Uh, da 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 da. Tony's house. Come on. This thing that's been hurting our hands so much, we finally have a pair of gloves to pick it up with. Because we stole everything from everyone else. Because fucking Wenzel stole all our shit. Fuck you, Wenzel. Nice. Okay. Now that we've got that, that, and that. Yep, we've got all those. Check that. I've got that, and I've got ex extraordinary stimulating. Got some hot beans. I need black powder. Water. I need a container. Shit. Alright. Okay, reading the walkthrough, apparently I need this. Well, Thank you, walkthrough. Here we go. Black powder. So now we have the black powder. Right, so now that I have the black powder, apparently I'm supposed to go to Tony's place and grind it up further. It's a ready powder. A pinch of black powder. Still two ingredients. Right. And I guess, uh, I guess I should mix them all, shouldn't I? Uh, grinder. Stimulant. Chili pepper. No. Nope. Give me the red hot chili pepper. One whole chili. That should be enough, right? There we go. Hey, Tony. How's it going? I'll call this blend... Rufus Reckless, the Maiden Slayer, <laughs> or Savior. Hmm. No, Slayer sounds much better. Yeah, it does. All right, I agree. Let's go. What do we need to do with this again? We got to give it to what's his face, right? No, we got to actually brew the coffee shit and give him the coffee powder. Hey. So I have the powder already. Yep. Okay, finally making some progress here. Oh, I'm gonna have to delete a whole lot of this episode. And I need a container, shit, okay. Let's go visit Wenzel again. Upstairs. Right, okay, I am cheating so much. I don't like this. But I couldn't get anywhere. Because most of it does not make sense at all. This wasn't half as funny as I thought it would be. True, it wasn't. What can I do? 
I mean, there's always been this here pipe. I've, I tried using that. Um, syringe? No, that syringe work. Dentist drill on the pipe. Oh shit, it's doing something. <laughs> well, what does that do? Wait, am I gonna go out, go out to the water reservoir, kick this, kick it? Yep, and now pull it. Ha ha! Poor Wenzel, his tender heart will break when he finds out that the well in his basement isn't real. <laughs> <laughs> Quick, I don't want to miss the moment. All right, get down there. Wenzel, I'm down here. Come quick! You won't believe your eyes. Poor Wenzel still thinks he struck water down there. His this is mean. His cellar is simply flooded. Bad luck. Rufus, you're an asshole. Well, Wenzel, maybe you shouldn't get too excited. Sometimes you just think you struck water, and then it's just... Wait a second. You really struck water. Unbelievable, isn't it? Oh, I shit. But that's impossible. And it's all thanks to you. Well, thanks to your father's divine rod. You are a true friend. You know what? Well, you're welcome. You shared with me, and now... Really? Of course. I share with you this very moment, the moment of triumph. Let's enjoy it together. <laughs> so what's that grinding noise? It's not my teeth. I see. I'm yeah. rich. Well, Windows rich. We did that. Better we're taking this divining rod. Okay. can see it clearly. Grit, and there's a uh, dead beetle. <laughs> clear water. <laughs> yep, he found clear water. Well done, Wendell. I'm glad you found your shit. Now I need to find a container to put this stuff in. Shit. Um, oh, yeah. So that. Hey, Wendell! Nice Hi. to see you, buddy. Rufus, I believe you may very well want to congratulate me. The mayor was very excited to hear about my discovery. He believes the water vein might make cool back one of the three richest settlements in the southern quadrant. Right now, he's hearing one more applicant, but for now, it looks like I'll be the one. Gold is supposed to live at your place? <laughs> Don't make me laugh. But now that I have a water vein on my property, I'm one of the most influential people of Kuvak. And with an orbit pixie in my house, I might even become an honorary citizen. Who knows? One day, I might even follow in the footsteps of your father. But I was the one who saved her, and I'm the one who gave her shelter. Rufus, you don't even have a house. So how do you suppose you'll convince the mayor? Well, I, uh, I'm... Why didn't I move in with Wenzel? Next up, number 63, please. All right. That's me. Hey. Hello, Lottie. You again? <clears throat> you, you again? Is it my turn already? Yes, it is. I already <clears throat> called your number. Can I? Okay, I'll Let's get, get up. Lotet, I have to talk to you. It's about. Where's the, where's the mayor? Lotet. Yeah, <laughs> what the fuck? Hey. What? Morning, big fella. Whoa, are you really sleeping in your desk? This is the mayor's traditional resting place. Before me, your father used to sleep in here. That was before he betrayed the community. <laughs> well, I can totally understand that. Well, he left you behind, too. Be that as it may, who sleeps in a desk anyway? Admittedly, the desk isn't aligned correctly with the planet's magnetic field, but your father had a device installed to correct that. What? Oh, okay. I came here for the Elysian girl. I'm here for the Elysian girl. They all are, but 
you're too late. The hearing is over. Over? Well, I was the one. I, I saved your life. But, but I saved your life. I find that hard to believe. Considering you're responsible for 90% of all injuries that happen in Kuvac. Well, but 9% of those ha have been my own injuries. Yeah. <laughs> 90% or 90%. Not in Kuvac, you are responsible for it. As far as I know, you might even be responsible for that girl falling from the sky. Uh, no, it was yeah. Different. I, I, I was. Dude, you wouldn't even stand a chance if the hearing wasn't over already. Uh, I have to help her return to her world. But I have to help her return to her world. To Elysium? <laughs> That's a good joke. You should know better than anyone else that there's no way to leave Deponia. Nothing that ends up on Deponia will ever leave again. My dad made it. That's neither probable nor verifiable. I know that's what you'd like to believe, but I believe it's more likely that your father ended up crashing into some trash heap. With your attitude, you wouldn't even stand a chance if the hearing wasn't over already. Uh, uh but I was the one who found her. It was me who found her. As far as I know, it was Panic who found her. Well, I found her first. And you just left her lying there? Uh, no, it was different. With your attitude, you wouldn't even... Well, shit. That's too bad. How exceptionally reasonable of you. I've made my decision, and there's nothing you can do about it. I'm starting to run out of good arguments here. Finally, there is a god. Are yeah. we done here? I really need to go to the assembly hall. You bet. Oh, now what? Instead of moving the desk, you chose to manipulate the planet's magnetic field? Well, he was the most egocentric and stubborn person I've ever met. That's a lie! Oh yeah? Why do you think he left you here? Because he didn't care about anyone but himself. Not even his own son. Not even for his own son. Pretty ironic that you've become just as egotistic as he was back then. Egotistic? Me? Ha! Just recently, I risked my own life to save a girl from the clutches of the Organon. Completely without ulterior motives, I suppose. You better believe it. My ass. <laughs> no surprise, Low Tech. I will save the girl. And then everyone on this planet will realize how selfless I really am. But then it'll be too late, because then I'll already be sitting in some... Are those tire marks? And laughing about you fools and how you still have to live in this junkyard. You'll see. There, there, are, there are tire marks on, the, on that carpet thing, the, the rug, the, the skin. So it was roadkill. I can't stop thinking about what you. Well, get over. Your father installed that device for a reason. He manipulated the magnetic field so he could sleep in harmony with the field line. I can't imagine how that's supposed to work. Well, it does work. I sleep like a baby. <sighs> the only downside is that carrier pigeons are constantly crashing into my window. Well, damn. All right. The girl belongs to me. The girl belongs to me. Wrong. I've already made the decision. I'm sending around a bit on mints. Finally. Are we done? That's all. That's it. Well, then just beat it. Whoa, what the fuck? You disappeared! Take this cushion. And it's draw. Wait, what? I didn't get anything from that. Ugh. S O L O N G Y O U F U C K E. Damn, where was I? <laughs> So long, you sucker. Communicator. Next, please. Hmm. Guess I'm last in line. Whatever. Who could possibly succeed except for me? Water emblem? Hmm. I kind of know this symbol. Yeah, that's because your dad was apparently the mayor here. Use the globe. Oh. Glass. Oh, that's what I need for the thing. I'll go do that. And I guess I will also lock the keyhole. Yeah, that would be fun. But no. Oh fuck. Okay, fine. 
I need a key for that then, I guess. Alright, we'll quickly make this thing and then we'll I'll end the video because it's, it's been almost fucking two hours. Uh, okay, yep. And uh, in here. And. Uh, it's gonna be a long episode. Oh shit, that's right, I forgot. Alright, yep, uh, need to go to this place. Get me that glass. Grab the glass. And use it on the acid. Yeah! Ha! I've siphoned the acid without injuring myself. I'll drink to that. Blech. Ew, why the fuck would you drink that? Dude, this is disgusting. Alright. Dude, how's it going? Oh shit, no, no. Uh, I want to. Da, 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 da. Wait, can I pick up the red curtain? Oh shit, I can! Um, here. Yeah. Have this glass of an energy rich liquid. Put it in God damn it. Alright, how do I put it give it to him? I brought some energy rich liquid. You stop bottom the acid? Maybe this thing will unfold again. For the love of my life. Well, for her sake, I hope that your life doesn't last too long. <laughs> okay. How do I mix it? Maybe I missed something. Go back to the office. BRB. Is there anything left in the thing? Oh my god. I missed something. That was a thing. Hmm. Alright. I guess we're done here then. Cut. No. Yeah, okay. The walkthrough says to do this. I'm not using it all the time, okay? Oh shit! Oh! A hidden compartment? Well, looks like Dad's secret will see the light of day after all. I just got stuck, okay? I'm not using it constantly. I see. My dad knew I'd be clever enough to find it. I wonder what I get for it. Yeah. Great. That's what you think about, is it? Keyhole. This might be unnecessarily complicated. But I'm certain Dad wanted to make sure that I'm the only one who can get this far. Get to his big secret. His legacy. It's something lame, isn't it? His liquor cabinet. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, brilliant. Is that all? Just the booze? So I should mix it with the booze, right? Mix the... Mix it with the tranquilizer? What I need now. Mix it with that. Hmm. The water's still lacking something to it. Right, so now it's energy rich clear water. Sweet. No, nope, red curtain. Toro! Hey, I said Toro! What, what good is it being the best of matadors if the bull isn't even looking? Okay, fine. Um, how do I turn the bull around? Toro! Hey! <laughs> oh shit, okay. Um, apparently I need a sign. Something to do with a cow. Where the hell would I find that? Maybe in here. Yep, cow sign. Found it. Ha! <laughs> That was not part of the walkthrough. Trust me, it wasn't. Please trust me. Everyone uses walkthroughs. Shut up. Ah, ah, ah. Brilliant idea, Rufus. What could a lonesome bull crave more than a well-chilled blast of Max Pit? What? Okay, I'll use the cat. Main thing is that it works. Yep, okay, and, 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 and this, and, no, nope. the, the grey curtain goes on here. Aw, does that upset you? Well, Aha! An accomplished matador like me knows how to bring the blood of a bull to a boil, or whatever liquid it is that's pumping through those tubes. Yeah, I need that liquid. I want that liquid. Use this, use the syringe to get that liquid. Draw blood from an enraged bull? <laughs> Child's play. 
Yeah. <laughs> Shit, what happened? Where did I go? Am I still alive? I mean, I already fell from there, so... Alright, so now it's in range. Can I take the curtain back? Nope, never mind, it's just gonna be in range forever. Oh, um... Put this... Put this... Move this... Into this. I already have the special water, at least. Alright, now I've got energy rich, revitalizing, and clear water. Ugh! Now let's make this goddamn coffee. It's espresso. Alright, bartender dude. I already have the special where do I pour it? Um into the tank you go. The tank? Fill it up. There we go. The tank you go. Sweet, I got it. Well, that's it. I found all the ingredients. Wow. Yes! Oh, I can't even tell you how excited I am to see what happens next. But I thought we were making espresso. Yes, you are right. This is an august moment, my friend. We shouldn't spoil it by worrying about the pressure within the nuclear core structure. Oh, pressure shit. Pressure within the nuclear core structure? Oh, no. Hear me, gods of our forefathers. Oh, oh, oh no. The most refined ingredients and the highest possible compression, we beseech thee, open the gates to the espresso verse. Uh, no. Smoke. Oh uh, no. More pressure, what have I done? More okay. Uh, okay. Go. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Seizure warning. No. Um, can we not die, please? That'd be great if we just didn't die. Shit. Are we... Are we dead? No. Being dead feels completely different. Oh, you would know. As you know, I have gazed deep into death's eyes more than once in my life. Oh, now that you mention it, that reminds me. Is Tony still wearing those contact lenses? Yeah, <laughs> she's dead. Something's happening. Oh. Oh, shit. This is a really... Really bad coffee. Good coffee. Bad coffee? Good coffee. I don't know, I can't really tell the difference that much. I got an achievement! This brew is gonna do the job. Alright. Lonzo. Oh, did you come to help me clean this place? Well, I got this thing going on. I'll come back later, okay? Alright, yep. Uh we're not gonna clean up. We're gonna go give this coffee to someone. Someone in here. I suggest not to move her in this condition. What kind of condition is she in? I still don't understand. I mean, is she dead? No, no. Her body is alive and well. It's her consciousness. It's inactive. So, she's asleep. Well, it's a bit more complicated than that. I think it's related to this implant. It's broken. A consciousness implant? Isn't there a switch or something? A fuse? Maybe the contacts are corroded. That's what always happens with my intercom. I already tried everything, but this is Elysium technology. I have no idea how it's being used. I don't even have the appropriate screwdriver. So, uh, when can I finally take her home? She needs to wake up first. Okay, okay, I see. This situation needs to be resolved through a government decision. Let's do it like this. If you manage to wake her up, you can have her. Oh, that's my turn. What happens if I wake her up? Focus! You're not even supposed to be here. But I have a plan. Yep, and a coffee. I've heard about your plans. You never think things through. Everything yeah, but I have a coffee. In chaos, and most likely I even have a walkthrough. <laughs> we'll see about that. I warn you, stay away from the girl. Nope, we are going to give her this awesome coffee. Here you go, girl. Drink this coffee. Stinging smell. That's medicine. Get Disgusting her. coffee. I, and who's the doctor here? <laughs> You tell me. Let's say it together. Me. It's a draw. Best out of three. <laughs> me. <laughs> ah, I win. Oh, crap. Great. All right. What's that supposed to? That's medicine. Who are you? 
Um, what do I do then? I want to do this before I end the vi video. I've made the espresso. Walk through. What do I do? Oh. Oh. It's been well, in my. You're welcome. It's it's been in my face this entire time. This entire freaking time. I used the hand torch on the cardboard box. What's that funny smell? I just set fire to something. Fire! The town hall's on fire! Fire control mode oh, activated. Shit. Firefighter is mall at your service. Where is the fire? Over there! The chamber's on fire! Good lord! Don't worry, your fire will be extinguished in no time. Alright, now let me go. Let me give her the coffee. Did he just walk into the fire? Oh, great. That's going to put out the fire, though. So I should hurry up with this. Go. Have some... Don't even think about it, Rufus. Keep your hands on it. This situation... What? What makes you think that? You should Wait. be glad that Inspector Gizmo's not around. Use the skip stethoscope. Finally, Wait, I'm the one with the stethoscope. So I'm going to be the doctor. Medical mode activated. Doctor Gizmo at your service. How's the patient? I'd say her condition hasn't changed. Leave the diagnosis to the doctor, will you? Now, oh, just where is he? My stethoscope, it's gone. Thieves, crime in progress. Police mode activated. Officer Gizmo at your service. No one leaves the crime scene. Uh, give it to Wenzel. <laughs> Gizmo might think Wenzel has stolen this, but how could I plant it on him? The thing is almost as big as. <gasps> oh god! You're not untouchable, low tech. Don't <laughs> ever forget Woo. that. That's enough. I think you're done. Uh, come on, Gizmo. You have more important things to do. Don't tell me how to do my work. Or are you oh, I am an awful person. My attention from your guilt. What? That's simply. Aha! Here is the missing clue. Last piece that completes the puzzle of the mystery of the thieving mayor has finally been solved. Thieving mayor? How dare you? Put up your hands, Lotek. I have no intention of lifting my hands. You better do what I say. I don't want to. You <laughs> don't have any choice. I don't? Well, you're fired. You can't fire me. You're arrested. <laughs> you can't arrest me. You're fired. But I arrested you first. So what? You're fired anyway. You can't fire me. You're arrested. You can't arrest me. You're fired. But I arrested you first. Oh, so what? I just You're fired anyway. Don't you can't fire me. You're arrested. You can't arrest me. There. You're fired. Right, the funnel. I arrested you first. So what? You're fired anyway. You can't fire me. You're arrested. You Oops. can't arrest me. You're fired. But I arrested <laughs> you <laughs> first. Just start out of so what? First. Right, how do I do that? You can't fire me. Yeah. You're arrested. You yeah, there we go. And uh I arrested you first. Okay. Oh, we're finally doing something good. <laughs> I what well how was that? Me. It was me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it was great. Are you alright? Alright, yep. Uh, uh, I'm just about done. Uh, I, yeah, this is where I'm going to end the video. Just don't stress her out too much. First and foremost, she needs rest now. No problem. Thanks, Doctor. No one's going to watch till this point. Fuck. <laughs> Gold, it's me. Your savior. Huh? No, it, it's Rufus. Mm. Yes. What? You can give me any name you like, babe. <laughs> uh, slash dash gazash? Mm, granny. Oh, Granny. <laughs> Munch crunch. <laughs> Munch crunch.
Grinch? And it's time for TikTok. <gasps> knock, knock. <laughs> this is adorable. Say, did it hurt a lot when you fell from the sky? <laughs> oh, come on, that was funny. <sighs> because, I mean, you, you really fell from the sky, you know, like an angel. <laughs> Just like in the in the pickup line, <laughs> do, do, do you get it? It's lame. Hello, anyone home? Home, 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 home. I'll take that as a yes with limitations. <laughs> get a hold of yourself. Guadeloupe. Yeah, she's attractive and fun to talk to. Hmm. All qualities you need in a girl. Or guy, or anyone. This is totally useless. That woman is completely nuts. Bonkers, quanta de bonkers. Oh, what did I expect anyway? That she would take me to Elysium? Elysium. We need to go back to Elysium. What did you just say? Horrible things. The Organon betrayed us. Quick. We need to go back. To Elysium. Yes, yes, you... You, you remember what happened? Was that you, Peters? What? No, I'm not. My, my name is Rufus. I saved you. Rufus? I don't understand. Where am I? You, you had a pretty bad fall. The doctor says that you're hallucinating. That's confusing, but... <sighs> I need to get to Cletus. Can you take me to him? Who is Cletus? My fiance. No. Well, I don't know. Maybe you are safe with that idea. After all, you. He'll reward you generously. Oh, that, uh, generously, you say? Try to contact Cletus. He will search for me. Yeah, yeah. How generous exactly is generous? Maybe you can reach him using a radio. He's certainly trying to find. Dodging the question. Do you really think that's a good idea? I mean, for a fiancé, he didn't really make much of an effort to protect you. Please. You're the only one I can trust. Yeah, that sounds about right. I really am the only one you can trust. The only one. And you're already proof that you're a noble person. <laughs> mm -hmm. The burden of the hero. But let's get back to the expression, generous. Rufus, please. Contact Cletus. I would be so very thankful. So very, very thankful. Don't say that sexually. He'll take it the wrong way. Sorry, I don't know if I can do that. Can someone tell me polo lollipop? Peekaboo. But. Who can swat a curse or love a shoot? Why do I always have to be so infinitely generous? All right, well now I'm ending the video. All right, thank you so much for watching and good. bye. Can I pull the lever now? Okay, never mind.